Hey, what's up guys, Crunchyclick here, and welcome on back to a brand new video. And in today's video, I'm going to be showcasing the scoreboard with no red numbers on the side. So, uh, yeah, hopefully you enjoyed, and let's get right to it. So to start this tutorial off, um, you want to do this command in a repeating and always active, but like, if you're doing something with redstone blocks like this, um you're gonna want to um, make it need re need redstone because obviously and uh, now to start it off you want to do slash execute at a squiggly line squiggly line squiggly line title raw and then at s action bar now a lot of people will be like oh but I want to do the scoreboard on the side well too bad because you need an add-on or whatever or a resource pack to do that and um, yeah, you can you can search that up, or I might have it in the description for you guys to download if you are able to do it. But if you aren't, then you can't really do it. But anyways, uh, after doing all that, you want to do the weird brackets. I don't know at what any of this is called because I'm too stupid. Okay, okay. Yeah, just basically copy everything down that you see on the screen right now. You can pause the video right now or whatever. Um, but basically. The first area where it says text and then it says in red test um, that is going to be your title and then you clone that text uh, and this is very hard to explain but uh, because some of you don't really already know how to do this a lot of people already do but some of you don't uh, but basically if you ever want to make a space like like that underneath where it says test and then there's a space and then it's your stats Um, you want to use that slash and then n because that is a space and then you're gonna do the exact same thing with the slash n with your stats basically just copy everything you see on the screen right now and you'll get the same result as that right there in the bottom of my screen and once you have done that I'm gonna show you how to do a money system for your screen see that um, basically I've added a cache right there but right now you're seeing new stuff that was added which is the text cache and then the score name objective ca literally if you want the exact same results that I have right now on the screen just copy it all down every single bit right here you might get confused this is like an X whatever you see here here my little two things in the middle uh, yeah, that is a X right here. Look, I'll put a pointed arrow at it. That is an X thing. It's not like an X, like it's a star, you know those stars? Uh, yeah, it's one of those. And yeah, you see where it says objective here? You want to create an objective. I, I, I had a little uh, issue yesterday with, with a viewer where they didn't realize that they needed to create a scoreboard for their scoreboard. So that was a bit of an L, but you have to do slash scoreboard objectives, uh, add cache, and then dummy, and then you will be able to have a scoreboard. Most people know this already, and then you do this, and it will add a zero to your little scoreboard. So, um, yeah. Oh, by the way, this is a repeat and needs redstone, obviously, but you might use a always active one. And by the way, if you ever want to add anything more to your scoreboard like say ranks kills and um, deaths or something like that you always want to use that objective thing uh, like because then you'll add a number onto your thing like you can change that number and uh, if that makes sense what I just said there but uh, yeah but anyways guys I hope you enjoyed this tutorial it may have been a short tutorial but it was uh, very efficient I think make sure to like subscribe and turn notifications on so you never miss one of these amazing tutorials and uh, yeah Guys, I will see you in the next video. Peace.